high amstel here. Okay, I'm going to go through the sequence to find the total resistance and combined circuits. Okay, I have students who have problem uh, starting to solve the total resistance and combined circuit because they do not know uh, how to start. Okay, so the key point here right, is that you solve either the pure series branch or the pure parallel branch first. Okay, so how to go about doing this, right? Uh, we look at circuit diagram 1. Okay, in circuit diagram 1, right, we have resistor A that is in series with a parallel branch of resistor B and C. So we see that B and C, they are in a pure parallel. So we do this first. This will be our step 1. Okay, then after this, right, we see that uh, resistor A is now in pure series with the combined resistance of B and C. So this will be our second step and we'll find the total resistance. Okay, let's take a look at another circuit diagram. Okay, uh, we see that resistor A and B here, they are in pure series connection. So this will be our first step, evaluate this first. Okay, then the combined resistance of A and B together with C and D, it forms a pure parallel branch. So this will be our second step. Then after we get this right, this combined resistance here will be in series with our resistor E and this will give us our third step. So this is how we go about doing uh, solving the total resistance in combined circuits.